Hello and welcome back to Rob's Homemade. Today, me and John are going to be doing the crisp review. You saw me do the Smokehouse Cayenne Smoking Hot. These are Seabrook's Fire Eater Scorching Hot Trinidad Scorpion Chili. I know how hot scorpion chilies can be because I use them in my butch scorpion blood sauce. Is there a double D? No. No, it's scotch body. So, warning extreme heat. Let's have a look. There's hot and there's hot. Then there's Trinidad Scorpion Chili Hot. Well named because they pack a real sting in their tail and will challenge even the most hardened chili lover's tongue in a way that no Christmas challenge. Best have a glass of milk and a towel on one side. Well, we don't need milk or towels because we'll, we'll be all right. Got through the chili. Well, we're just so about over that, I think. And place yourself. Remember, it's a sharing bag, which is why I'd, I'd I've only come for three crisps. <laughs> Same reason I'm here, mate. Three crisps. That's it. And not the ultimate <laughs> individual heat challenge. We're going to bang these all through. No smell hot. I don't smell much to be fair. But it's all at the bottom in it. Seabook crisps. I do like seabook crisps. Oh, some fair. darkens in there. Yeah, I think we'll have to give for the some darkens, some lightens. So we're gonna have to go and pick these out. I mean you don't I knew you're gonna go that we're gonna go for a fair few. I think we'll have four. Do we have four or five? We'll go mm -hmm. five. So these are supposedly the world the world or should I say the hottest supermarket crisps that are out there at the moment so we shall we shall see i'm sort of crisp sandwich well, yeah get the cheese in there will be all right <laughs> let's go three two one so i'm actually quite hot here on your tongue yeah there's a bit of burn there really tasty to be fair I bet like, yeah, these are lighter ones. There's not much flavour on them, but after we've had a couple of the hot ones, that's not going to taste any different, really. We're going to have another stack. I ain't going to pinch all the hot ones, though, will it? We'll have a stack of three. I think after a bit it'll build up. Mm. They're tasty. I like them. So this is lunchtime sorted. Mm. I don't know what the ingredients are, they read that. Have a look, John. We've got uh, potatoes. Huh? I don't know, we should hope there is some potatoes. Bird's eye chilli, Trinidad scorpion powder. There's no percentages. Habanero chilli powder. They are quite spicy. Nice though, they are good. They are tasty, but <coughs> they're not screaming hot, but I think they were hot enough to actually class them as that. I mean, I, I don't think I've had any hotter crisps than this. I want the one chip, that's what we need. We need the pack, yeah. We also need to have a Satan, but we'll sort that out. <coughs> but they am. They're all right. They're yeah, tasty. They but they am quite spicy, I think, for the average person. Do you know what I reckon? Oh, got the, um, maybe the Walker's Max Jalapeno ones seem a bit spicier than mm. these. I don't know, it depends what I've had to eat, probably. Yeah, but... Mm. We've got a bit of fire. I would call them scorching hot, but I would call them hot. The non chili head, you definitely uh, Enjoy them, you? would probably be grabbing milk right now. But, yeah, lovely. There's a cup. See, the smaller ones that I'm all grab, these are the, the bad boys. The bad boys. <laughs> Let's have a couple of them. I'm having that boost. Knock yourself out. Yeah. They're really they're, nice. They have nice crisp as well. I do, like I said before, I do like Seabook though. Seabook do make nice crisp. And I've got to say, they are probably the hottest shot board. I so. have. Yeah. I don't know about the Max Strong, the jalapeno and cheese ones. They were hot, hot but I think these have got more of a burn to it. The looks building. Yeah where the jalapeno just stayed at one level yeah. where these sort of raised right, they're yeah. getting hotter and hotter so yeah quite happy to share the bag with John yeah, we'll have a couple more yeah, I think we'll call it a day how much right? yeah 
So that was our review of Seabrook Scorching Hot Trinidad Scorpion chips. Very nice, very nice indeed. Definitely worth it. I don't think we'll give them a five chili rating, but the same as anything supermarket, I think they do go a bit too far. I give it a three. Definitely a three. Yeah. I but agree with that. No way a five. But if you're not a spice head, then but it's like, maybe a five. Yeah, you know. you're probably normal, probably normal person. Yeah, definitely a tongue burner. I and mean, I can feel it burning now. So if you're ever in Tesco, these are very these are limited to Tesco. Only Tesco's going to sell these. Grab yourself a bag. That's the, definitely the hottest out of the three. I only tried two. I didn't try the chili and mine, so I couldn't be bothered. But the smoke can and the Trinidad ones are well worth the money. Definitely. Seabrook did a good job. Thank you very much. So, me and John are going to go and finish these crisps off. And we will see you all again very, very soon. To do the beer. For more, oh, yeah, much yeah. better. <laughs> I don't think that's allowed on dinner breaks, so John. No, I only don't beer on dinner breaks. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> only don't beer on dinner breaks. Yeah, non alcoholic, non carbonated piss water. Mm. <laughs> Actually, we could just call him and get away with it. No, probably not. <laughs> no, maybe not. Especially as it's been recorded. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Me and John will be back for more reviews, more challenges. I've got loads and loads of ideas. And you never know what I'm going to pick up when I go shopping. So stay tuned and see you all soon. Peace!